All right, this is a tutorial on how to set up Camtasia Studio 6 and capture game videos. Um, since I can't run two instances of Camtasia, I'm going to run this in my VMware, so that's why you'll see XP, not Windows 7. Um, so here's my VMware. Let's go full screen. Okay. I'm going to start up Camtasia. I'm going to click record screen. Alright, first let's set the resolution that we want. This little crosshair, right click, presets 640 by 480 is going to be all our game videos. Now go to tools, options, save as AVI, because Camrec is only editable in Camtasia, which we don't edit in Camtasia, we edit in Vegas. Video, manual, Let's set this to 30, that should be good enough. Video compression, we want uncompressed. Uh, this will give you the best results, granted the largest disk space usage. Um, you can try capturing in, in TechSmith, although when I play games with it, the video ends up like half frames, I don't know why, it's like 10 or 15 frames no matter what I set the frames per second too. Um, so it's failed me. I stick with uncompressed. It's up to you guys to play around with it. Um, maybe you, you, you won't have the same results. I don't know. Um, so that's it. D when you uncompress, there's don't, no settings to set because it's uncompressed video. Audio. Uh, what you want to usually do is, let me see, this one. All right, there's usually an option here that says what you hear. Uh, that's usually the one you want. Um, you can, if you don't have that, you can try playing with the other ones. If your sound card is there, you can try that. Whatever your your speakers are, uh, that's that's the one I use. Audio format, PCM. Probably want the very last one, 48 16 bit stereo. Let's see. Okay. Oh, that should be good. You can set up your hotkeys if you want. I don't use any. Um, that should be good. Alright, now Camtasia is set up to record correctly. So let's test this out. You're going to just run Naomi and I'll do a little test game. Alright. What you want to do is drag this. Alright. If you do locked application, it's going to lock everything, including the title bar. You don't want that. You, you never want to deviate from 640 by 480. So you want to get this just on the inside. I know it, it's flashing a little bit. That's only because it's VMware. It's got to be just on the inside of the entire screen. That looks good. I'm not sure if this is going to load, but if it doesn't, you do get the idea. So, once it's all the way in the middle, it's loading just extremely slow. Alright. Basically, hit record. It's going to start recording. You can get rid of this timer, too, if you want. Any options. Alright, that's going to be recording. Also, one thing you don't want to forget is you want to hide your cursor. That way, if you go like this, you won't see the cursor in your in your movies. That's important, which I've done a few times and I've had to remake movies because of it. Once it's done, you're done doing your gameplay video and your title video. Click stop. It's going to create the video file. Uh, depending on how long you recording for this could take a minute or so especially uncompressed you'll notice it does take a while to create the video files you can let it play it's faster just to click save I'm gonna save it alright since I'm not actually saving it yes alright so 
gonna do one for gameplay and one for title. If you want to do a couple game sh uh, gameplay shots, then you can do that too. All right. Um, I think that's it. And now this is gonna play better, of course.